Yeah, so lo looking back on the, on the start of, of 2022 and the season in the last couple of months, you know, how, how would I describe it? I would describe it as busy. Uh, a lot's gotten done. Uh, you think back to the end of last season, right? New staff, uh, pretty significant overhaul to the roster, new sponsor on the front of the shirt, uh, new provider. A lot of changes down here at the stadium. I think for the positive, we brought the Carolina Challenge Cup back online, which was awesome. Yeah, so I guess like any any other business, you know, challenges kind of come from everywhere. Uh, we had a very powerful storm system that came through, a bunch of tornadoes in the area, sustained some, some damage to the facility down here. Uh, it affected the southwest corner uh, of, of, our, of our stands. Uh, nothing kind of long term, uh, just a couple of repairs that we need to make. We're working really hard to do that. Uh, hope to have everything back. Um, as soon as possible, we can still have a you know still have a great crowd, and, and um, luckily the the pavilion on the north and east side of the stadium were, were untouched. Um, so just a unique set of circumstances, and we'll work through it. Yeah. So the assessment on the field is uh, you know the results kind of speak for themselves. Uh, you know, obviously it's been a it's been a rough patch. Um, you know, not not totally unexpected. Uh, just a, a ton of change, right? A new staff, new system. Like anything else, it's it's a process. You know, we we have a lot of uh, belief in in what we're doing. Uh, we think we have a really talented group, and you know, we're look, looking forward to them coming together. Kind of worked out nicely here. We have a bye week early in the season, chance to work on things. So I, I think this is hopefully a two month stretch where we can really find our way, find our form, and then really. If you think about Louisville coming in, it's an awesome test, right? They're the best team, you know, at the top of the table in the East. They've kind of been the standard bearers the last seven years. I think you want to measure yourself against the best teams. Uh, so a good result there, build some momentum. And then after that, we've got another, you know, string of home games. So the a message to the fans is the same as it always is, which is come on out here and support the guys. Uh, they're working their butts off. Uh, the energy in the building matters. They feed off it and uh, they need your support. Got a great, uh, great run of games starting on, uh, on April 23rd against the top team in the Eastern Conference. So let's get out here and support the guys and uh, start racking up some wins.